Aidan, great to have a chance to speak to you for the first time and, and after scoring in front of the East Bank, not, not a bad time to do it, is it? No, it's a very good time, uh, especially after coming off bench for 10 minutes, I think making an impact is what I need to do to get myself on that team. And it was an instant impact, wasn't it? Yeah. It must have been a matter of seconds coming on and then going up the other end and, and slotting it under the keeper. It was a good finish, yeah. wasn't it? Yeah, I was, uh, did think I messed up with my first touch, but recovered well and put it in. So. His goal is a big part of your game. It's, you know, we've seen bright sparks from you this <clears> pre-season, but not too much as of yet. But you know, it's looking encouraging. So, so would you, how would you describe your game in, in, well, in your normally, own words? Um, giving me line and I'll play well and just go at defenders. But today I thought I'd come in for a bit, come inside and score a goal from it. So maybe cutting inside and being inside more in the box is how I need to play from now on. And. Uh, Scoring more goals, but scoring goals is always something I've done and used to get annoyed at myself for not scoring. Um, but I've started to learn goals aren't everything and assists matter as, just as much. So getting everyone involved is really important. You're very early on in your career, aren't you? You had a, a very impressive breakthrough season up, up at Bracknell last year and, and the highlight reel we got sent over for when we announced your signing was, was brilliant. So, you know, I mean, how was that last year, making that breakthrough? <clears throat> it was... Um, I think it was well deserved. I put in a lot of effort last year, uh, the year before for Sandhurst, mm. when we were step six and played like 11, day, 11 games in 20 days and put in all that effort in for the season after to be rewarded by Jordan, the Bracknell manager, to bring me up with him and be given the chance to play at step three and show everyone that I can do it at whatever level I want to be at. Yeah, and, and playing men's <coughs> football is obviously the way to get into it, isn't it? So was that a bit of a... Because well, you must have been, what, 17 at the time? Yeah. Freshly 17, so yeah. was that a bit of a harsh welcome? Yeah, I mean, I was kind of used to it from being 16 playing men's football, but after I came back from my ACL injury, I went straight into men's football, so I had to adapt the way I played instantly and learn to use my body more than, and use my head more than just using my feet. And talk us through that ACL injury, because that must have been a horrible thing to have at such a young age. Yeah, so I'd done my ACL when i just turned 15, um, and it took, kept me out for a year and two months as couldn't get instant surgery. Uh, knocked me back a bit, but I never thought I couldn't do it now. And I just wanted to keep going and prove everyone that no injury can stop you being what you want to do. Like, just determination just got me through. And you've managed to get through the whole of pre-season with the lads now. How, yeah. how's, that been, how's that settling in period been? Um, the lads been really welcoming, to be fair. Um, yeah, I mean, it's great quality to be a part of. Like everyone is unbelievable. Like there's not one player that isn't able to keep the standard very high during training sessions. Everything is much faster paced than I'm used to. But I think I've done well to keep up, and the boys have kept my head high. And when I make little mistakes, they keep me going. They don't put me down, which is always a positive. A week away from the season, are you excited to see the EBB Stadium? <laughs> A bit more pat than it's been this pre-season? Yeah, yeah, I'm very excited. I mean, fans really up everything. It's what we do it for, we do it for other people, we do it for ourselves and put people, put smiles on people's faces. It's just... Hopefully more goals at the EBB. Yeah, that was first of many. <laughs>